we with the woodcutter? 38%? What are you guys doing? 43%? We need food! We need food and logs for the winter. Why are they not collecting trees? Why are they collecting iron? That's... That's not what you're supposed to be doing. What are you doing? People are lazy. Look at them. Look at them just walking around and that woman just... Wow, she just put away an entire block of stone somewhere. Okay, getting even more nervous because it's early autumn. It's probably going to start snowing soon, but our woodcutter is coming up nicely. Uh, so hopefully uh, that will get built relatively quickly. Uh, because how much food do we have left? We have 243 food. 260. 63 food. 263 food, it's autumn, and we have nothing. Oh boy. Oh boy. I'm getting, I, I, as you can hear, I, I'm a ball of nerves right now, but it is, uh, I love simulation games like this. It's just, it's just fascinating getting to, like, look around and watch your population, like, just work. Just, and it, it's fascinating to see all of this just come to life. And, uh, just come to life. And uh, just build itself, and see all the little all the little things that are going on. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. Let's see. Okay, so our woodcutter is built. Now we need to set priority on the fishing dock because we need to start catching some fish, or else uh, I'm afraid Big's town is going to uh, is going to die. That's that's the long and short of it. Um, but. Hopefully not. <laughs> so what do we need to get done? We need to get the uh, we need to get the fishing done. Uh, we need houses. That's gonna come next. And I don't know if I don't know if I should build the uh, if I should put more emphasis on the gatherer's hut or the houses, given that it's autumn. Oh boy, there's snow. Yep, I need to put emphasis on the houses after the fishing dock is done. Um, how many citizens do I have without jobs? Three. Okay, and I have five workers working on this, so it should be done relatively soon. How much firewood do we have? None. Oh boy. How much firewood have you produced? 24. Okay, hopefully that'll get us, uh, hopefully that'll start getting us, like, where we need to be. But until then, uh, ooh, good, 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 we have fishermen. We have the fishermen, and now we need houses. Uh, we're running low on food! Yes, we are! That is a fact. We only have 239 food stored. Uh, okay. Alright. Well, it started snowing. So hopefully uh, we can get these houses built, get these people inside, and get them using the firewood that this guy is... Uh, kind of chopping up for us. How much wood have you produced? Only 13. Okay, well, that's, uh, that's that then. Um, so, uh, once it becomes, like, spring again, why do my statistics keep moving? Uh, once it becomes spring again, what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to, well, I should probably do that now. Uh, I'm going to get a plot of land ready to be farmed, um, maybe put down a well just in case of fires because apparently that's a thing that can happen to you you can be set on fire and that would suck I also will be building a schoolhouse which is very cool because once you build a schoolhouse uh, your people become a lot more productive and uh, things get built faster let's see ay 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 are people still putting things in that? they are Okay, I need to get rid of that. I need to get rid of uh, that cart because we don't need it anymore. Because uh, we have this big barn here. Uh, cool. So we have one house. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Yep, five people in each house. Uh, they are freezing and starving, and oh boy, we are freezing. That's not good. 
this may be it for Bigstown. Oh boy. Oh dear. Everyone's freezing and starving. Okay, but anyway, once it becomes summer, um, I'm probably going to set up a piece of land uh, so that it can be farmed soon. I will also build a school. And... Uh, maybe a... Ooh, maybe a tavern. Tavern is nice. Uh, tavern, but in order to have a tavern, you have to have uh, either a forest lodge, uh, or a gatherer's hut, or a... Um, Claim. So it's removal resources. Okay. Uh, you have to have some sort of like fruit uh, that you're gathering or growing because that's what they make their ale out of. And I have not, as of yet, successfully built a tavern because every time I try, my town dies out. And I get very sad, and then I stop playing for like 10 minutes, and then I go back. <laughs> because my addiction is strong. Oh no! Someone died! Ah! Uh, oh no, another person died. Oh dear. Yep, we're... We're getting f fairly screwed. Because nobody has a house. Oh, come on. I put priority on the houses. Oh, yep, I think this is the end of Bigstown. This may be the end. Oh boy. Yep, yep, there they go. More people are dying. Oh, dear. Oh, well. I guess that's what I get for trying to expand too fast. Um, I'm thinking the formula for a... Um, for hard mode to actually succeed. Yep, there goes another one. Um, the formula for hard mode to succeed, I think, is probably to build houses first and then build, like, some sort of food source. I think. And then, like, by that time, uh, and maybe, like, a woodcutter, too. And uh, by that time, it's probably winter. And then, once summer comes, you build the rest of the stuff. But Me, being the expansionist that I am naturally, decided that I would throw caution to the wind and see where it took me, and it took me to death. And, yep, there goes another one. Uh, let's... Let's fast forward to ten. <laughs> let's see where this goes. Maybe we'll make it to, uh, maybe we'll make it the next spring, and we can, uh, we can come back, because apparently you can come back with just two people. Or three people, even. But... What are these guys doing? I don't know why they're not building the houses. Because no one has tools. And there goes another one. <laughs> another one bites the dust. And another one gone. Another one gone. <laughs> uh, it just breaks my heart. Breaks my heart to know that I can't run a society effectively or else I'll kill them all. <sighs> Seriously, why are these houses not getting built? You'd figure that these people would want to build the houses, and why are, like, six people just hanging out at the dock? Oh, wait, it's just two people. They're just completely out of tools, and... Okay, that's why. Oh, that's kind of sad. And there goes another one. I have five people left and one child. <laughs> oh, wait, here we are. Wait, oh, no, go back. Early spring. But it's still cold, and people are still freezing, so... All right, so I came out of the winter... Uh, I had ten people and, like, six children, but now at uh, early spring, I have five people and one child left. Uh, do I not have any builders left? I have one builder. One builder left. God, how sad is that? I'm so sad. Alright, well... Let's set up the priority on these houses. Well, maybe one house at a time. Maybe that's why they were getting so confused, because I kept trying to make them do two houses at once, and uh, they can only do one. Actually, you know what? Set priority on that, because that needs to be taken down. And another person died. Well, we have no children left, and uh, we have four people remaining. 
And that was the end of Big Stop. Yeah, um, I'm gonna cut off there. And, uh, start... <laughs> Can't they just keep dying? Oh, God. I'm gonna cut off there and start a new game on medium because hard is just way too hard. Alright, welcome back. We have, uh, I've started a new town, Biggs Town 2, and wow, we started right in the beginning of early spring? Why is there snow? Uh, Biggs Town 2, uh, on medium this time because hard is still too insanely hard for me, I think. Uh, which is very sad for me to admit, but it is true. Uh, so in medium, we start off with 1,800 food and a bunch of resources that we can use, uh, to start building houses and uh, kind of getting our shit in order. Uh, so what we're going to do first is I'm going to build, let's see, three houses. Let me flip the screen a little bit here uh, to where, ah, there we are. Uh, let's see, flip this so it's here. We're going to build three houses, uh, allocate some builders. So... If you take away anything from what uh, you saw before with Bigstown 1, uh, take away what not to do. <laughs> because that is apparently not the best way uh, to go through and uh, play in hard mode. <laughs> okay, so uh, in medium mode we'll have uh, a lot more time between seasons, I think. I think the seasons pass a little bit slower. Um, and we can actually concentrate on uh, getting our shit set up without uh, without sort of shitting our own pants the first year, uh, which is what happened during hard mode. But yeah, my game shit its pants for an entire year. Uh, and it starts you off with uh, more people than children, it looks like. So that's good. Uh, more people to uh, work and uh, bring in the houses and whatnot. All right, one house almost built. All right, good start, good start. Uh, another thing, let's see. Well, let's let's finish these houses first because that, that really needs to be done. Uh, how much firewood did it give us? Uh, fire, we have 200 firewood, so we're good on firewood for a while. We probably won't have to build a woodcutter until um, near the end of spring, or uh, summer, I mean. So we should be good. Uh, getting all those trees cut down, getting some stone. Uh, well, actually, I don't think they're probably not gathering the stone because I didn't specify them to. All right, Let's specify to gather the stone as well because we gonna need that. We gonna need a lot of it. Uh, medium mode is great because it starts you off with a start uh, with a storage barn first rather than the. Um, uh, rather than the uh, the cart, uh, because the cart doesn't hold all that much, and you got to take time to take down the cart, and you know, fucking move all the stuff, all that jazz that you don't have to deal with in medium mode. Oh, let me flip that. There we go. Get us a fishing dock and a road going to it, because that'll be, that'll be needed. Boom! Alright, uh, so soon we have our houses, uh, soon we will have our fishing dock, and uh, we can continue on, and uh, maybe get to where we were last time, but actually succeed. That would be nice. I, I would like to succeed. Succeeding feels nice. Okay! Uh, I've kind of gotten back to where I was before. I have my fishing uh, outlet and I have my forester, uh, but instead of building a, um, a woodcutter uh, at first like I was going to, um, I'm going to build a, uh, a gatherer's hut first um, because that's a, a food is a little bit more important in, uh, in the summer. Um, but I'm going to build a, uh, a woodcutter right here, probably, like right next to the stockpile. Uh, so he has easier access axes, uh, access to the wood that we are gathering. Um, and everything will run a little bit smoother, I 
think. Uh, gotta build another row going down. Here we go. Oh man, another really convenient thing about this game that I haven't talked about yet is um, you can actually move the screen with WADS, W-A-S-D. Oh my god, it's such a blessing. Or you can, like, if you're really used to moving with, the, like, your uh, cursor at the very sides of the screen, you can do that too. But, oh my god, it is so much easier to just move around with WADS instead of having to go, uh, and keep your mouse there, and you go, and uh, you can move your mouse around while you move the screen. Oh my god, it's so convenient. I love it. <laughs> uh, let's see, what are we running low on? Nothing, really. That's good. That's very good. Uh, they're producing. Uh, Gatherer's Hut is not being built. What are you guys doing? Oh, there are still people without homes? What? Oh, well, I'm here. Let me uh, get another house in here. There we go. Another house is being built. I keep pressing space for some reason, and I keep stopping time. I'm really sorry about that. Uh, I don't know why I keep doing that. Okay, I have a couple people working on this, a couple of people working on that other house. Uh, people working, people building, people living. Probably gonna have to replenish the stock soon, aren't I? Let's take out these. Because there's a lot of stone in here, there's a lot of trees that we can use. Um, yep, see the reserve of food is low, oh dear. Oh yeah, we went down to 145 food, jeez. For winter, for when we need our firewood. Uh, because firewood is very important, as you guys saw in my last game where I played on hard. And uh, I got screwed. <laughs> By the weather, big time. Let's see how much they produce so far. Already they found onion. wow, already they found onions, mushrooms, and roots. That's good. That's good, so we'll have food during the winter. Thank god. Because running out of food during the winter is probably the worst thing that can ever happen.